hello again. Uh, I suppose I should try and get this working. There we go. Good, you can't complain. Glad to hear it. Welcome to part four of Mass Effect playthrough, I guess. <laughs> So if you don't remember where we were last time, we had just arrived at Peak 15's garage to go and chase down Saren. Uh, I can't quite remember anything else other than Nav uh, Navaria is a bit sus. So we're going to resume. Again, no spoilers please. Uh, I want to try and play this blind. Mm. But the way the sun's shining at the minute, I'm surprised I'm not already. Yeah, no. You're, you're too good for that, Chrissy. You're too good for that. Do you like my new shirt? The one that I mentioned I couldn't wear at work. <laughs> right, these guys are now both in here. We should probably take some cover now. Ooh. Hello. Uh. Oh boy. Oh boy. This is such. Uh. No, it's not. It is a. It is a website that specialises in like kind of retro equipment and some other stuff like that. Straight past the cover. This gun's pants. Gotta shoot these guys, like, it can't be hard, right? Oh, you're dead. Hey, you're dead. There's someone over there. Over there? Right, oh, you're dead now. No, you're not. There you are. Oh yeah, how are you finding it? Uh, no. No, you did not. 
So it's not up there. Where do we go then? I have no clue. So the general consensus is they don't like the cold. Who knew? I can't get up there. You can't jump. So... Where on earth am I supposed to go? Oh, there's a ramp here. Oh, not great kit. That'll be useful. I'm sure. What do you want? A hammer two. What do you have? A hammer three. So you can have a reaper three. Upgrades. Sure. Nothing there. Uh, Yeah, I saw some about the uh, the uh, alphas. I haven't, like I said, I've not really played it though. So I mean, oh, hello, exploration people, it's a good idea, guess we'll take those, because useful. Oh, give me one second, assault rifle, oh, baby, Yes, absolutely. Oh boy, it's cold. Who would all oh, look all the enemies? Well, you're dead, so ha 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 ha. You're dead. Nearly. There you are. Oh well, you're dead now. Oh, headshot! Grade 4 of pit. I oh, know, right? Hello, top hat. That looks fun. Ah, oh, they're Rackney. 
Well, they're a bit dead. A fire containment system. Probably not going to be useful. There's a terminal here. I don't know what a terminal is. Oh, it's literally a journal entry. I can, these guys will be fine. Mind you, I keep saying that about Garrus, and then he ends up getting fucking dead. Uh, yeah, sure, okay. Somewhere over there. Not my problem. Who's miles back? Come on, Garrus! Elevator. Damn, well, that was a shit shot from me, wasn't it? Haha, <laughs> they can't open the door. Oh shit, that was not a good idea. Uh, great, I guess. <coughs> I don't know if they were upgrades. Probably, well, I know we got some pistols here. I mean, it's an accurate shotgun. Oh look, there you go, there's some, some good. Oh, I've got points. Shit, I didn't realise. He's getting there slowly. Uh, you really should start investing in electronics, my friend.
to roof and comms. I have a feeling we might have to go there. Ah. I have no idea what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't actually know what to do here, there's no... That doesn't help, honestly. This doesn't help! As far as I can tell, there can't be anything in X. Hundred and eighty one Omni Gel, fuck it. It looks like you're trying to restore this facility. Would you like help? You're the virtual intelligence that runs this place? This system is monitored to respond to the name Mira. 
May I ask your name? Why do you need to know? To determine the data access available to you. Basic access is limited to non-secure queries. Secure access allows... To be fair, I just said fuck it and I'll use the Omni gel. I ain't dealing with that. Commander Shepard, I work for the Citadel Special Tactics and Reconnaissance. One moment, please. Council authority confirmed. You are entitled to secure access of all systems. Please note that queries relating to corporate secrets require privileged access. Privileged access is only available to Binary Helix executives. This system is ready to process queries. You may access me at any holographic interface within Peak 15. I need to find Matriarch Benezia. Lady Benezia departed on the passenger tramway to the Rift Station subsidiary labs. User alert. The tramway system is currently inoperable. What's the situation here? One moment, please. Diagnostics in progress. Critical failure. Main reactor shutdown in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Critical failure. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger tram systems are offline. Report complete. Do you have an additional system status query? Do you know why the reactor was shut down? I'm sorry, but I was offline at the time. Shutdown could occur if reactor breach seems likely, or in the c Emergency guidelines suggest the frigid environment will kill biological contagions. It may also damage mechanical ones. Turn off the heat and hope the cold puts whatever you've unleashed to sleep. What are the landlines, and why are they disabled? The landlines connect my mainframes here at Central Station to the various sub-facilities of Peak 15. This allows the crew to remotely access my databases from the comfort and security of their labs. When emergency protocols were implemented within the hot labs, the cabling was automatically ejected. How do I reconnect the landlines? The landlines are designed for easy reconnection. The router for the landlines is on the roof of operations. Simply activate the controls and the hardware will reconnect and reboot automatically. Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. The creatures we've encountered here, did they come from the lab? I'm sorry, Commander. Inquiries related to our research require privileged access. Only executives of Binary Helix have that level of clearance. Why were you taken offline? In the event Peak 15 must be sterilized for security purposes, my program and data are purged. They kill you if something goes wrong? My systems are permanently disabled. To be killed, I would need to be alive. I am merely a database program. Tell me what occurred immediately before you shut down. Stage 1 alert issued at Hot Labs. Contaminants released from Laboratory Pod Gamma. Emergency protocols implemented. Stage 2 alert issued at Hot Labs. Isolation 2 breached. Tram shut down. Landline to Hot Labs disconnected. Stage 3 alert issued locally. Contaminants in tram tunnels. Station shutdown and evacuation initiated. Code Omega sent. What sort of contaminants escaped? I'm sorry, Commander. Oh, you Those fucking bent. Research require privileged access. Bye. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging you out. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. Now exiting to the roof. User alert. Landline connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. We're all on the roof. Oh, lovely.
user alert. Main reactor shut down and according to the containment procedures. Manual restart required. Is this game just gonna keep repeating that phrase over and over and over Long again? Connections are disabled. Passenger trams are offline. Restored. Processing new data. User alert. Unable to connect to Probably. facilities. Tell me what happened here. I'm sorry, but I need a more specific query. What's the status of Rift Station? Rift Station has been locked down by the staff. There are presently no contaminants within the facility. Give me a status report on the hot lab. I am sorry. The network connections to the labs have been damaged. You have no idea what's going on inside. I'm afraid not. My last log entry is shortly after the stage 2 containment alert was sounded. Give me an overview of the facility. The hot labs isolate dangerous biological or cybernetic contaminants during development. The complex is built within a glacier. In the event of an accident, it can be irradiated and sunk into the ice. That's convenient. That's all I need right now. Very well, Commander. Logging is out. Probably. Uh, I suppose I should start. Did Did you have a level four shot? Well, you do now. And what was it, a level f 4 pistol? Now, uh, is there anything else around here? Probably not. I haven't dug into the codex yet, but I will probably most likely do that when... Maybe, maybe not on stream. Shut up! Accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. I don't actually know where these are. Kind of my issue. So there's the passenger channels which we can't get to. This door's open though. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. This is awful elevator music, it just tells me that everything's shut down. What is this, fucking Skepta?
start required. How are they just ignoring my shield? I might just let the AI deal with it, because they seem to know what they're doing more than I do. with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Oh, hello. Garrus, where are you? Oh, piss. Didn't want to... Uh, Garrus. Oh, I can't change the upgrades on it for some reason. I mean, it would be useful if he has that anyway, even though if he ain't gonna use it. Huh! 
I know who could use that upgrade. Oh, did I open the door by accident? Yeah. Well, I got fucked in the ass. I don't know how much of that I'm going to have to redo. I imagine a lot. We're all the way up here, really? Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. Yeah, but even so, that's... The lack of checkpoints is going to be what really hurts the length of this playthrough. The only good thing is, is that I can just about remember where I went. User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency... How can I have a green health bar if it's... I don't understand the health bar in this game. If it's green, isn't that like an overshield or some shit? User alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Manual restart required. I've also noticed that the items in the crates are randomized each time you fucking die as well. That's arguably better than the one he just had. Marcus Junk. Oh, well that's not very... 
That's bad UI, that. Green meant to mean good, not bad. Might just be me, though. Oh yeah, well I remember. Uh, what do you want at the minute? No, right, Rex. Where's Garrus? Start required. That's not useful, though. I mean, if it flashed red, that would be more understandable. But to me, that means good. It's like the overshield in Halo. You can't just say it's green and then give it a negative status effect. When red is meant to mean bad and green is meant to mean good. They do it for the doors. Just saying. In accordance with emergency containment alert. procedures, main reactor shutdown in acquired. Fuck, man. Use alert. Main reactor shut down in accordance with emergency containment procedures. Will restart required. I imagine there's probably something over there actually, so we're gonna quickly. Oh, there's the marker. Yeah, but I'd rather have it on the AI to a degree because I usually send them up the front lines. 
Oh, hello. Up there. Hello, friend. Oh, shit. We'll have to flank it anyway. They're a bit slow. A bit slow to get going. Got him! Eventually. Right, that should have saved everything from all that, which is kind of a nice thought to have. I don't think there's anything else you can actually collect in here, I don't think. I might be wrong though. Yeah, oh maybe. Yeah, I know. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah, they're basically on their specialties already. They're already on their specialties, pretty much. I usually just tend to leave them on their uh, on their preferences, honestly. So the other door on the other side should now have opened, right? Oh, wonderful!
I don't know where the other two are, but they're nowhere near me. They're already set. It's already set to all. Restored. Processing new data. User alert. Unable to connect to hot lab facilities. What's this about loose contaminants? Dangerous biological agents are present in the tramway decontamination chamber. The tram station has been sealed in the interest of crew safety. Activation of the fail-safe plasma jets is recommended prior to access. How do I activate the fail-safe system? Controls for the fail-safe systems are located in the security of course they are. outside decontamination. User alert. The fail-safe system is currently inoperable. What would it take to get the decon fail-safes operating again? There is a hardware fault in the control system. This can be repaired on-site using a standard Omni tool. Tell me what happened here. Oh, bye. Well, I can't repair that right now. He killed himself because he was part of whatever happened here. Oh, I didn't realize there was more. Oh, that was close. Well, you're dead now, so haha. -ha. Oh, lovely. I'm just gonna wait for my health to heal. Then these two go in front of me for now. They know what they're doing. I do not. Destination blocked. Mm, no, it's not Garrus. It's right there. Garrus, you drunk fam? Oh, there they go. Now they start moving. Uh, I'm assuming this is the tram system then. Apparently neither of them can get here, which is pretty funny. Oh, here they come. Oh, now you tell me. Too late, man! Now arriving at Rift Station, Binary Helix Research Facility. Well, that door doesn't work, does it? Can we... <laughs> Emergency, my ass. 
So we can't go to the hot labs. Not yet, anyway. Hello. Stand down. Sorry, we couldn't be sure what was on the tram. Did those things work at trains controls? Hell if I know. I'm not assuming any goddamn thing. Look, you're human and that's enough that I won't shoot. I'd like to know who you are. Commander Shepard, Systems Alliance Navy. My crew came up from Hanshek. Didn't figure you space jockeys liked getting mud on your boots. The aliens overran the hot labs last week. Only Han Olar got out. He ain't all there anymore. First, we knew the bastards were clawing into my command post. We had a lot more staff then. You were taken by surprise and had civilians to protect. You did a good job, Captain. Yeah? Sure as hell doesn't feel like it. The board sent an Asari to clean up the mess. She went to the hot labs yesterday. We haven't heard from her since. Venezia. Is she still over there? I don't know. I don't see what one person could do. There's an emergency elevator out by the trams. This card will let you activate it. It can take you down to the hot labs. Oh, if you need me first aid, Dr. Cohen's downstairs in the med bay. I don't, do I want to go into all this shit? Tell me about Rift Station. I can't talk about everything. What do you need to know? Tell me about the defenses here. Secure enough that you shouldn't poke a corner. I was just impressed with your operation. Being able to weather a week of assaults is no mean feat. Only the best get assigned to high security facilities like this. What impresses me most is the turrets, alarms, and cameras. They're all routed through a central location out by the quarantine lab. One guy can lock down the whole facility. The security hub's the last logical fallback, and we'd have cover from the turrets all the way. What kind of research you've done here? Beats me. I'm not supposed to know. As long as people don't start dying, it's not my problem. I need to know more about the situation in the hot labs. The facility's off the network. The only way to find out would be to send scouts down the elevator, and I won't send my people to their death. Did the aliens come from inside the facility, or did they attack from outside? You want my personal opinion? Labs like that exist to do stupid crap that gets people killed. What can you tell me about the aliens? Ask Dr. Olar. He's the only one who made it out of the hot labs. He's the only bolus left in here. How are your people holding up? We weren't expecting the initial wave. We made it inside. Some good people. Those of us left are shorthanded. We've kept order by long shifts and stems. I don't like it, but I don't see an alternative. I've got work to do. Yeah, I hear that. Hell! Man the perimeter! Well, that was short lived. I'm assuming it's this way then. I don't know what's even up here. Do I want to know what's up here? Oh, there's a medic. Ah, oh, there's a doctor over here. I think. The medical bay is downstairs. Too restricted area. Warning. Watchdog protocol is active. Oh, it didn't like that. It really didn't like that. I don't know what I expected, honestly.
Oh, I didn't read your chat message. <laughs> Well, you told me too late. Boom, headshot. Boom, no scope. Well, we survived that. Just about. Should I save? <laughs> I mean, there's got to be something in here, right? Like, surely. Uh, I did. Why? Should I not have? I don't really have a choice now, do I? You didn't tell me not to! I mean, now how am I meant to know this? I told you I'm playing this game blind. You didn't tell me not to do it. And I don't really have much of a choice now, do I? And I didn't open fire on them, they opened fire on me. I mean, I guess I can't go back, but I'm still assuming you can get to the hot lamps this way. I still don't actually know where I am. I'm now kind of just one, like aiming, one wandering aimlessly. That's what I was trying to say. Ah, so that was the hot labs entrance that we couldn't get in earlier, was it? Oh great, what's that supposed to mean?
I mean, there's a lot of, like, weapon crates here, I suppose, which is kind of useful. Ah, thank you, Chrissy. I mean, they didn't say I couldn't go into the restricted areas, but it's not my fault I didn't know that that was a bad. Other than the fact it clearly said restricted area, but the fact it gave me the option to open the door is probably half the issue. Are we back where we started? We are! Hello. No. Hello. Uh, that, that doesn't look particularly happy to see us. Well, it's dead now, so jokes on them. Right, so we don't go that way anymore. Uh, quarantine and barracks. We've already been there. This is the tram. So it was this way we needed to go. Yeah, because I remember now, because there was like another door over there. Oh, I've got to shoot my way out of this shit now, and I save the game. You got me all paranoid now. I know. Oh, hello. His fault. Boom, headshot. Well, we shot our way out of it, I think, mostly. Oh uh, yes, are you gonna Are you here to secure the situation? That's right. I'm a council specter. Who are you? I am Yaroslav Tartakovsky, the operations director. I would stand and shake hands, but uh, he must listen to me. If we do not contain our mistake, they will drop bombs from the battle stations. You understand? You let these things out? Uh, I am only following the orders. Binary killers found an egg. It was on a derelict ship, thousands of years drifting. This was Rachna's ship. Inside they find many eggs in cryogenic suspension. Rachna? The Krogan wiped them out a thousand years ago. That is so. Billions of lives lost in that war, on both sides. They brought it here to wake it up? Binary killers planned to clone Rachna, mass produce them create an army, but when they get here, they find this egg is not a common ratna, it's a queen. After she lays eggs, they move her to Rita Station. They are thinking that without her, they can raise the babies to be obedient. Hold on, don't you need a male to get eggs? Queens are born carrying the genetic code of their fathers. Eggs are carried away from the colony to hatch alone. Queens can lay eggs in hours. And have a colony in days. This is how they spread so quickly. Separating them from their mother didn't work. Ah, this was exactly the wrong thing to do. I am thinking that without a queen, Rachni do not develop properly. Her mind is shaping theirs. These Rachni are uncontrollable. 
Then all we need to do is bring her here. No, I'm sorry, but this will not work. These Rachni are beyond saving. It is a sad thing, but they must be euthanized. Uh, I am thinking that the Neutron Purge must be set off. I'm not familiar with the Purge system. Same, bro. Create burst of Neutron radiation. Kill everything within the station. Things beyond get genetic damage of varying degree. How do we set off the Purge? Armin controls are nearby. All you do is insert the key. Then I will get oh, that's lovely. All predator style. Yeet! I love the AI did fuck all there. Like, thanks for saving my ass. I like how that's even an option, just straight away. How many Rachni are in here? I'm sorry, the sensor network is too damaged to provide an accurate count. Give me your best guess. Guessing is beyond my design parameters, Commander. Are there any survivors in here? Yaroslav Tartakovsky, Director of Operations, is on the operations deck. There are no other living crew members within the lab structure. Is there an Asari here? There are no Asari visible to my remaining internal sensors. What's the status of the facility? Containment breach in laboratory pod Gamma. The neutron purge system is functional, but has not been armed. Activate the neutron purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. <laughs> not the correct code. Please report to security for arrest and interrogation. We're moving on. Logging you out, Commander. Great. So now we gotta go find these. Why? Well, we've got the push codes. And let me guess, you've got a time limit to absolutely leg it out of here, like a leggy boy. Online, how can I help you? Activate the neutron purge. I'm sorry, but I can't do that without proper code authorization. Code input, 875-020-079. Code Omega, local execution. Verified, code Omega. Oh, lovely. I hope you're ready. Come on, AI, do something. There we go. Now they're doing something. They're trying now. I guess I'm supposed. Well, Garrus is down. Nothing new there. That's one way to cheese it. <laughs> Are we just gonna leave now like nothing happened?
So I'm guessing our mission is still not done here. Because that door's still locked. And I'm assuming we can't exactly go wandering back into the hot labs. Uh, well, considering that door is off. Is there something I'm... Can we even go... We can't go back in there. That is officially deaded. Aren't you just glad we nuked the place? Haha, <laughs> 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 bomb go boom. Whoa, this way, I suppose. I mean, nobody's alive. Can't exactly go that way. I don't actually know what we are doing here. Am I supposed to know what I'm meant to do here? There's a door control over there. Quarantine lab locked down, because of course it is. So how do you unlock it? Nothing here. Oh, elevated to restricted area. Of course it is. Oh, wait. No, because we were in there, weren't we? Weren't we? Pretty sure everyone here is dead. Yeah, it was. Everyone here is dead. So there's someone in here we got to look for. Yeah, nothing there. Okay. Uh, I guess we have to go to our destination then, which is by the trams. Well, we're at the office. It's saying we need to be here. Is this game lying to me? I doubt it, because look, there's another one over there. Now it's by the tram.
But there be nothing here. Oh, I've got some more score points I didn't know about. <laughs> I've only got heavy armor cubes. Fuck's sake. We got to look for... Well, yeah, but... Mira's not helping. I'm pretty sure they mentioned last time where she was, but... I can't remember where the Mira ter terminal is. I'll be completely honest. Definitely not one here. Because I've broken into the restricted area, it says time to see what's going on here. I'm clearly missing something. And then this goes into an elevator, so there's clearly nothing like here. Oh, there we go. Found it.
I guess we just kind of have to camp somewhere and shoot shit. Uh, well, that didn't last long for Garrus, did it? Because he's a... Come on, Garrus, get up. You should, he can heal though. Very slowly, mind, but he can heal. I recommend you go there, fam. Where you're in cover. <laughs> Headshot. Thank God for healing items. Save those med kits, yeah. Oh, she didn't even fall on the floor. What the hell? Well, you're dead. Ha ha ha. <laughs> Can you go there? Boom! Headshot! Where are you hiding? Headshot! I'm glad I dealt with that when I could. What are these guys doing? Sending the Krogan in. One day, buddy. There you go. There we go. Betray him. You will. You. You must listen. Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. Why are you able to break free of his control now? I sealed a part of my mind away from the indoctrination, saving it for a moment when I could help destroy him. It will not last long. Are you saying he brainwashed you? People are not themselves around Saren. You come to idolize him, worship him. You would do anything for him. The key is Sovereign, his flagship. It is a dreadnought of incredible size, and its power is extraordinary. Sovereign's not like other ships. Where does it come from? I cannot say. The Geth did not build it. Its technology is far more advanced than that of any known species. The longer you stay aboard, the more Saren's will seems correct. You sit at his feet and smile as his words pour into you. <coughs> it is subtle at first. I thought I was strong enough to resist. Instead, I became a willing <laughs> eager to serve. He sent me here to find the location of the Mew Relay. 
Its position was lost thousands of years ago. How does something that big go missing? 4,000 years ago, a star nearby went supernova. The shockwave propelled the relay out of its system, but did not damage it. Its precise vector and speed are impossible to determine. As millennia passed, the nebula created by the nova enveloped the relay. It is difficult to find any cold object in interstellar space, particularly something swathed in hot dust and radiation. Someone on Noveria found it? 2,000 years ago, the Rachni inhabited that region of our galaxy. They discovered the relay. The Rachni can share memories across generations. Queens inherit the knowledge of their mothers. I took the location of the relay from the Queen's mind. I was not gentle. You have to give me the location. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take it, please. Knowing the relay's location isn't enough. We need to know where to go from there. Saren wouldn't tell me his destination. But you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. You have to stop me. I, I can't. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You should, you should, ah, oh, you should. Die. Ah, oh, at least it's saved. You know, guys, it would be extremely useful if you, you know, shot her, maybe? I cannot go on. You will have to stop him, Shepard. You're free of the indoctrination again? I still hear it like metal on metal, squealing and reverberating. I mean, if you're gonna die, just die? This one serves as our voice. We cannot sing. Don't not say that. In these low spaces. Your musics are colorless. We filled you with enough plasma to pop a tank. This vessel is at the edge. Yet she struggles. You cannot it's like someone's cooking something outside. We are breathing on the embers. We are the mother. We sing for those left behind. The children you thought silent. We are Rachni. How are you speaking through her? Our kind sing through touchings of thought. We pluck the strings, and the other understands. She is weak to urging. She has colors we have no names for. But she is ending. Her music is bittersweet. It is beautiful. You are not in harmony with those who hope to control us. What will you sing? Will you release us? Are we to fade away once more? 
There are acid tanks rigged up on that thing. Set them off. Millions of my ancestors died to put these things down. Don't let them come back. If you kill her, you consign an entire race to death. We should let the Citadel Council decide her fate. Your companions fear the truth. You have the power to free us or return our people to the silence of memory. Fuck's sake. If I let you live, would you attack other races again? No. We... I... do not know what happened in the war. We only heard discordance, songs the color of oily shadows. We would seek a hidden place to teach our children harmony. If they understand, perhaps we would return. You could have calmed them if I hadn't set off the purge? No. Our minds are not as yours. We can only learn to sing in the harmony. Without a mother, That's what I'm trying to find out. Are lost to silence. You should not sing of them in grey and violet. We would have still them ourselves. Are you a survivor from the war? A clone? We do not know. We were only an egg, hearing mother cry in our dreams. A tone from space hushed one voice after another. It forced the singers to resonate with its own sour yellow note. Then we awoke in this place. The last echo of those who came out from the singing planet. The sky is silent. I think the better question would be, does this decision affect later down the line? I don't know. See, letting the council decide is what I would do because I'm a diplomat. Freeing them would be get bad against uh, Rex, and me shooting them, I don't have the nerve to do that. The neutral one's freeing. <laughs> It's a it is a decision. Like I said, this one is the neutral option because but it's obviously word against action then. And obviously Rex is here. If I Rex wasn't here I'd have no issue freeing him because Rex is here. Oh boy. Let me just re go over their plans and then I'll decide. If I let you live, would you attack other races again? No. We. I. Do not know what happened in the war. We only heard discordance, songs the color of oily shadows. We would seek a hidden place to teach our children harmony. If they understand, perhaps we would return. Rex is going to hate me. I 
I won't destroy your entire race. You'll go free. Are you stupid? Your people didn't fight these bastards, so maybe you don't get it. Maybe you've been blinded by old war stories. Do what you want. My people will clean up this mess later, just like we did for the Solarians. You will give us a chance to compose a new? We will remember. We will sing of your forgiveness to our children. Great. Bugs are writing songs about you. Mark my words, you'll regret this. Plus 24 Paragon. Jesus Christ. Right. Can I even remember the way out? Uh, it was around here somewhere. Don't think Rex is happy, but... We can now leave Navaria, which is kind of a nice thought. Oh look, there you go, that's where the door comes out. You bastards, you locked that the entire time? Really? Bruh. Oh, I've got more points. Um... Oh, there you go. Yeah, yeah. Now we need to get off this base. Do we have to run all the way back to the ship? That's a long ass way to go. What's our next move, Commander? Head for the Mew Relay? The Mew Relay could link to dozens of systems. Unless we know exactly where Saren's going, we'd just be wasting our time. The Commander's right. We can't rush off blind. We need more to go on. What about Liara the Sony? They're the Matriarch's daughter. Isn't she some kind of expert on the Protheans? Yeah, right. Her mother was working for Saren. I bet she is, too. Malezia helped us in the end. Maybe Liara will, too. At the very least, we should head for the Alchemist Tau Cluster to find her. Who put you in charge? Did the commander resign when I wasn't looking? We're all on the same team here, William. She's just trying to help. Sorry, Commander. This is a tough mission. We're all on edge. Everyone go get some rest. Crew, dismissed. Novaria report is away, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the Council? Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. Is this report accurate, Commander? You found Rachni on Navaria? And then released the Queen. Do you have any idea what you've done? How many generations until they overrun the galaxy? This Queen is different. She understands why her kind had to be wiped out last time around. I hope you're right, Shepard. Our children's children will pay the price if you're not. We'll be waiting for your next report, Commander. Sparrow needs to calm down, the tad. What a dick. Right, so we completed Naveria, pretty much. At least we don't have to go all the way back to the ship and it just kind of teleported us there. That was kind of 
convenient, I suppose. I'm gonna twist it more this way so I can sit back in my chair. Am I still on camera? Let me know if I'm still on camera. Hi, have you met real life? message from Alliance Command coming in. I'll patch it through. Shepard, this is Admiral Hackett from Alliance Command. We've got a situation here, and you're the only one that can handle it. What do you need, Admiral? There's an Alliance training ground where we test weapons and technology and live fire simulations. One of the VIs we use to simulate enemy tactics in the drills is no longer responding to our override commands. It's gone rogue. Are you telling me this computer is thinking on its own? We're not stupid, Shepard. This is a virtual intelligence, not a true AI. It's not self-aware, and it can't access any external systems. We didn't do anything illegal here. Virtual intelligence support is critical to our military success. VIs process thousands of status reports and react in nanoseconds. No human can do that. We need you to fight your way through the training ground of the VI Corps and manually disable it. Don't worry, Admiral. I'll take that thing out. I know Spectre's answered the Council, but you're still human. You're still part of the Alliance military, and right now we need you. The VI controls all the facilities, weapons, drones, and automated defenses. You're the only one that can pull this off, Shepard. Good luck. I don't know if I'm the only one. Just why me? That's a big bay. We still haven't unlocked the Solarian squad mate yet. I don't even know where they are. I don't know where they are. I probably should. I'll probably jump back on the ship in a minute then, but I don't know. I don't actually know like where they are. Exterior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the standby shore party. Decontamination in progress. There's a bottom floor. Logged. The commanding officer is aboard. Exo Presley stands relieved. Oh, 
Oh, this. Oh, that's Caden. sense of where the crew's at. Thoughts? Is this an official evaluation, Commander? Or off the record? All right. Let's label it officially off the record. Got something on your mind? Straight up, there's something wrong in all this. This serum is looking for a lost mass relay or who knows where. But we can't get backup from the Council? Sorry, Commander. There's writing on the wall here, but someone isn't reading it. The Council doesn't want to believe anything's wrong. I call it human nature, but... I hear you. It, it just seems like a group that's been around as long as the council should see this coming. Sorry if I got too informal. Protocol wasn't a big bulk of this master plot. Tell me about it. Biotic acclimation and temperance didn't last past the airlock to the kids they hauled in from the brain camp. Sorry, hauled in from the brain camp. We were <laughs> encouraged to commit to an evaluation of our abilities so an understanding of biotics filed. There are worse results of accidental exposure to element zero in the air. Beats the brain tumors some kids grew up with. Is there some question about how you were exposed? My mother was downwind of a transport crash. It was before there were human biotics, a little after the discovery of the Martian humans. It only gets iffy around 63 in Canadian. Am I still on camera, Top Hat? Let me know. Zero is Gagarin Station, right? What's it like? Yeah, that's the official name. Biggest and farthest facility we had for decades. Right on the termination shot. Outer edge of the solar system. It's where they did all the goose chase FTL research before we caught on to the last shot teams. A sterile research platform if I was them. Jump Zero is a long way from home. What was it like? The grand gateway to humanity looks a lot better in the but that's my own baggage, Commander. No bearing on this. Alenko, there's no regulation that says you can't be friends with your Commander. I appreciate that, Commander. I just don't want you to think that I'm a... a whiner. Besides, I've got my pass squared away. Uh... Yeah, who, who would have thought? Who would have thought? That is one slow ass elevator. Give the time, give it time to load, I guess. Shepard, what can I do for you? What's your story, Max? There's no story. Go ask the Corian if you want stories. <laughs> you Krogan live for centuries. Don't tell me you haven't had a few interesting adventures. Well, there was this one time the Turians almost wiped out our entire race. That was fun. I heard about that. You know, they almost did the same to us. It's not the same. Seems pretty much the same to me. So your people were infected with a genetic mutation? An infection that makes only a few in a thousand children survive birth? And I suppose it's destroying your entire species? I suppose it isn't all the same. I don't expect you to understand. But don't compare humanity's fate with the Krogan. Sorry, Rex. I wasn't trying to get you upset. Your ignorance doesn't upset me, Shepard. As for the Krogan, I gave up on them long ago. The genophage infected us. But it's not what's killing us. What can you tell me about the genophage? Ask the Solarians if you want details. They made it. All I know, it makes breeding nearly impossible. Thousands die in stillbirth, and most never get that far. Every Krogan is infected, everyone, and no one's rushing. 
Krogan tried to find him, too. When was the last time you saw a Krogan scientist? You ask a Krogan, would he rather find a cure for the genophage or fight for credit? He'll choose fight because he's hot. It's just who we are, Shepard. I can't change that. Nobody can. Are your people really dying? We're sure not getting any stronger. We're too spread out. None of us are interested in staying in our own system. Lots of species have left their homes and prospered. But they go to colonize new worlds. We're not settlers. We're warriors. We want to fight. So we leave. Hire ourselves out. And most of us never go back. So long, Rick. That was a fun conversation. serve the Alliance, Chief, but they're allies. At least as far as Saren goes. This is the most advanced ship in the Alliance Navy. Agreed. I think we should give them free reign to poke around the vital systems. Engines, sensors, weapons. You don't trust the Alliance's allies? I'm not sure I'd call the Council races allies. We, humanity, I mean, have to learn to rely on ourselves. How do you get from relying on ourselves to mistreating our allies? I don't mean we should mistreat them, Commander. I just think we should be prepared to go it without them. As noble as the council members seem now, if their backs are against the wall, they'll abandon us. You've got a pessimistic view of the universe, Williams. A pessimist is what an optimist calls a realist. Look, if you're fighting a bear and the only way for you to survive is to sick your dog on it and run, you'll do it. As much as you love your dog, it isn't human. It's not racism, not really. Members of their species will always be more important to them than humans are. You sound like one of those terra firma party pamphlets, Chief. Terra firma is a pack of jackals. The I'm trying to tell her off. These days they just play off xenophobia and bigotry. I hope my reasons are more rational. My father, grandfather, great-grandmother, they all picked up a rifle and swore the oath of service. I guess we just tend to think of Earth's interests as our own. <laughs> that's a blood oh that's like just shut up <laughs> all right i can see where your concerns are coming from Williams. but this is a multilateral mission you're going to have to work with aliens like it or not it won't be a problem commander you say jump i say how high you tell me to kiss a torian i'll ask which cheek would you kiss anyone i ordered you to that depends sir if you ordered me to kiss a superior officer, that would be a violation of the regs concerning fraternization. That would make it an illegal order. I'd be required to decline and relieve you of command. Sir. We'll talk later, Williams. Looking forward to it, sir. That was an entertaining talk. choice. I'd hate for you to regret it later. Well, that's sort of why I teamed up with you. It's a chance for me to get off the Citadel, see how things are done outside c -Sec. Either way, I plan to make the most of this. And without c -Sec headquarters looking over my shoulder, well, maybe I can get the job done my way for a change. 
That's a very blunt way of looking at it, Top Hat. If getting the job done means endangering innocent people, then no. We get the job done right, not bad. Got it? I wasn't trying to. I understand it. Hey, Commander. Looking for some extra supplies before you... Not right now. No problem. <laughs> you ever heard that meme about an interrupting cow? That's kind of what that was for a hot moment there. about your people our lives aren't easy resources are scarce and we are constantly on the move everything we do must in some way contribute to the continuation of the migrant fleet there are 17 million quarians in the flotilla and each of us relies on the others for survival the bonds among my people are strong unfortunately we have had to surrender many of the freedoms and civil liberties other species take for granted the music isn't helping. <laughs> it's too spacey. It's illegal for parents to have more than one child. If our population grows too much, it would strain our resources to their breaking point. Of course, we also can't allow our numbers to become too few. If our population is in decline, the rule against single births is temporarily repealed. In extreme cases of population decline, incentives are even offered to encourage multiple births. Though the Conclave hasn't had to take such measures in nearly a century. That's your government. The Conclave is our civilian branch of government. Each ship can elect a representative to serve on the Conclave and make decisions that affect the fleet as a whole. On matters that affect an individual ship, however, the captain has the final say. It's a tradition that dates back to the early days, when the fleet was governed by martial law. Fortunately, most captains nowadays are smart enough to have an elected county from their crew to give them advice and guidance. So the ultimate power rests with elected officials. In practice, the conclave and the respective council for each ship tend to set the rules that govern our daily lives. But in theory, we are still under military jurisdiction. The five top-ranking military officials in the fleet serve on the Admiral. These five have the power to overrule any decision by the Conclave in case of emergency. To do so requires unanimous agreement among the Admirals. And they can only do this once. After that, the entire board must resign their posts. It's a safeguard that served us well. In nearly three centuries, the Admiralty Board has only overruled the Conclave four times. That's enough for me. I should go. Right, I suppose we should actually go and start with Pharos now, which I mentioned in part 2 that we were going to do in part 3, but we didn't do that in part 3, did we? 
Yeah! <laughs> Would I need to level everyone up? Look at that balance, do boy. That balance is best sick blood. I like how Ashley is all. You could technically get away with like some next level squad. Oh, fair enough then. Forgive me. Forgive my naivety. Apparently, I make up like that much of the biotic and combat strength. Which is pretty funny. Uh, Glitch King 99, thank you for the follow, my friend. Good to see you here. You know, I'm, I'm just going to end up taking the same squad like half the time, apparently. Interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley has the deck. How are you, Glitch King? Fi Dan wants to speak with you immediately. Who? Why? Who's Fi Dan? He's our leader. He needs your help to prepare for the guest. Oh, it's director. Push. Please, up the stairs past the freighter. Why are you on Sam's computer? Yeah, but why? <laughs> Don't you have your own account? <laughs> I didn't know we were doing budget Star Wars. Right, so we came out that. So we gotta go through here somewhere. But where? Well, it's clearly not through there. And it's clearly not up there. Where, where am I meant to go then? 
Apparently we're still in a fight, which is a lot of lies, we're not. <laughs> Do we get out the wrong side of the ship? Probably. I don't know where to go. I am impressed at how easily I get lost in all this. Oh, it's there. Oh boy, Geth. I love Geth. Oh, there you go. I'm gonna say, why were you on Sam's account? The AI have that, uh, that auto lock. Uh, it's dead now. <laughs> the AI have that auto aim. Ain't that a mood? <laughs> oh, Commander, I'm glad they finally sent somebody to help us. You're a bit late, aren't you? Arcelia. Sorry, Commander. Everyone's on edge since. Watch out! We've got gas in the tower! Protect the heart of the colony! So, more shooty shooty bang bang? Ah, I got the first shot in. Sucks to be you. I'm assuming they're up here somewhere. I'm sure we'll be fine. God, I am so inaccurate. Well, you're dead. Bro, he put a shield up right as I fired. Oh, uh, you're dead. Uh, we can't go up any more stairs, so... Not now, Shepard! I was <laughs> gonna say, can you, like, fucking move? Ay, ay, ay. Well, they're dead. I didn't want to quickly... Oh, oh the door shut behind us. Of course it did. Oh. 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 Can you, like, die maybe? Well, you're dead now. Oh, you're dead. Oh, 
Oh, you're definitely dead. All of them are dead. Hello, boy. Slowly. Oh my word, so many upgrades. Uh, nothing really there, honestly. Nice. Uh, pretty sure Garrus is already on OK armor. He's on light still. That's generally better. Generally. It finally let us oh let us go out now okay I see how it is you bastards I don't know what's over here I guess we're about to find out hello Magoo mr. Magoo Well, that went boom. Oh, you're dead. Ha ha. <laughs> How are you? It's been a little while. Why can't I leave? Oh, it's that way. <laughs> I know what I'm doing. I am a competent Mass Effect player. I I promise you guys, I promise you I'm a competent Mass Effect player. Because this is the same guy that regularly forgets to save, and I haven't saved since Neveria, which is probably a bad sign, so we should probably save. Uh, I have no idea where I'm going. Oh, it's down here. Oh, lovely. Oh yeah, what Lego set you building? This valve looks like part of a large system. There are likely others we need to activate as well. Looks like it's on yet. We should keep looking. Where on earth could water valves be? Probably more over there, somewhere, I would assume. I still have no idea where I'm going. Oh, back here. 
Second tower is secure. Thanks. Oh, 9-11, okay. Is that the Technics one? I'm just glad your colony is safe. I appreciate your concern and your efforts against the Geth. They may have been slowed, but they'll be back. They always come back. Help me find what the Geth are after and you'll all get out of here alive. We don't know what they're after. They came, they attacked us, that's all we know. Their main base is at the Exogeny headquarters. A good place to start looking if you want answers. What's Exogeny? It's the company most of us work for before the attacks. They fund this colony. The Skyway leads directly to Exogeny headquarters. You can't miss it. Of course, there's an army of Geth between here and there. I didn't expect this would be easy. Then maybe I can get this colony operational again. Uh, some about water pumps. We need those Geth destroyed. Marcelia is right. There are still Geth in the tunnel. We also have more mundane problems like food, water, and power. I'm not sure where we stand on those matters. You should talk to the people overseeing them. Is there anything I can do to solve your water shortage? Mark Doyle. Ah, the big that particular issue. If you have any insight to offer, please speak with her. I'll talk to you when I learn more. to relax and accept what's happened. Tell me about the colony. I can't tell you much about them. You best ask Pi Dan if you really must know. Why can't you tell me? I just want to know about the colony. Pi Dan is our leader. Who better to answer questions about the colony? Well, aren't you a dick? Please do what you can to stop the attacks. Oh, there's a terminal there. Uh, we got some more lore. You're the one who repelled that last wave. They'll be back. And if the Geth don't kill us, we'll die of hunger soon enough. Are you doing anything to remedy the situation? I need to boost rations with Baron meat, but it's too dangerous. The Alpha Baron, he's huge and he's mad. Rabbit me, totally uncontrollable. I can't do anything until he's dead. Tell me about hunting Baron. Hunting them is impossible while fending off the gap. On the positive side, they'll attack anything, even those damn synthetics. The big Alpha Baron is the real problem. He's mad, erratic, completely unpredictable. I have to go. So long, Peter. Oh, there's an exclamation mark over here. What do you want? Why can't I go there? God damn it. Commander, what can I do for you? Some of the colonists are acting strange. We're a close knit group, Commander. Most of us have lost loved ones, friends. These aren't trained soldiers. Nobody taught us how to deal with the horrors of war. This is our home. We've watched the Geth slowly destroy everything that is important to us. Don't judge us too harshly. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck, Commander. Right, so now we've got to go... Somewhere? That clearly says to talk to Fai Dan, but... I'm not sure where we stand on those matters. You should talk to the people overseeing. What's wrong with Mayo Connell is working on our power problems. She'd know more about it. You mentioned something. Davin about Reynolds is tasked with securing food for the immediate future. I'll talk to you when I learn more. Right. So we did try talking to Davin Reynolds, and he says something about. in the tunnels. Why is everything always in the tunnels? Why can't you just... Everyone knows what happens if you go in tunnels though. You get deaded.
Oh, that's why I didn't see a staircase here. That's on me. Oh, is this the big Geth fight room thing? Hello. Oh, of course I was. Thanks, Xbox. I mean, isn't they're trying. They're trying at the very least. Lovely description. Well, it's dead now, so. We got them all, Shepard. Well, that was easy. How the hell was that vehicle even there, though? I think it's a better question. Uh, is there anything over here? Probably not. Oh, there's something down here. Oh, hello! <laughs> More geth. Who would have thought? Walk right into that one. Garrus, for fuck's sake, get in cover! Why are you here? You don't want to go down there. What are you doing down here? See you, Magoo. Thank you. I should be anything I shouldn't. No! That was a good one. It's very intense. What's the matter with you? Just invoking the master's whip. Helps remind me I'm still alive. You're here for the geth, aren't you? You're not the only one interested in those things. Who else is looking for the Geth? Not looking for. Looking to get rid of. They're a thorn in the side of the- ah! I'm trying to get to the- <laughs> Let's go. He can't help us. Is there anything I can do to help you? Do you even want help? Help me? No. No one can help me. I'd rather die fighting! Fighting what? <laughs> Not that kind of fight. It's like running through a thorn bush. The more you struggle, think I'm losing brain cells. Time's up. Company's coming. Ask my dad. Ask him about the. Ah! I like how we all have our weapons ready. Oh, lovely. Would you be interested in doing the dead? You done now? Nope, nothing this way. So there's water pumps around here, right? Apparently not. Can 
you imagine someone just breaking out into song for he's a jolly good fella? I don't think he's all that jolly. Just saying. Well, that's good, I guess. So we've got water running back to the place. I guess the fuel system power core was a thing we needed for the power. I guess. I don't know, I just went and picked it up like I, was, I have no idea what it does like at all so we sorted their food, we sorted their water, we got some about the power I think I killed the big bear. The rest are yours. Excellent. I'll organize a hunt when the immediate threat of the gap is gone. I have to go. Here, for your trouble. It's not much, I know, but it's all we can spare. Kind of old school. work with those geth. Glad you showed up. I still need the power cells for this generator, though. I found these power cells in the tunnels. Are they what you're looking for? I knew they'd turn up eventually. Here, my dad gave me some requisition money. It's all yours. Yay, I'm rich! Right, so we've done... Oh, hello. <laughs> Her jaw like fetch quests. <laughs> that's a that's a I'll talk to you when I learn more. Good luck. Right, so now we've gotta to go to the Skyway, I'm pretty sure. I guess I do have other shit to do at some other point in time, but now is not that time. I like how the elevator's here. Oh, there's a vehicle. Well, it's dead now. Ha ha. Hey, it's the Mako. Oh, cry around.
fair enough then. No good sniper rifles here. I don't have any points yet. It's funny because Garrus is quite well rounded. Then there's me who's just <laughs> Yeah. All all speech, no real skill. Uh, and Crow and Rex is slowly getting there. Slowly. I find it funny though that the two AI have fully maxed out this on their auto, which I found pretty funny. So with that, I think I'm going to save. We'll get in the Mako some point soon I think uh, maybe not now we've done a good couple of nearly three hours nearly I've still got to go and eat food and then I'm back at work Tuesday Wednesday so we'll see about a stream then and then Thursday for the next day off we'll see we'll see it's been good though been fun um, so we'll have to see what happens. I'm just going to make sure I've definitely saved it. There we go. Right. So I think I'm going to call it a night. It's getting a little warm in here actually. Uh, it should be okay though. Cheers for joining Top Hat. Uh, I have no idea what next stream will probably be. It'll either be... Don't forget the codex. There'll be a test later. <laughs> Great. Uh, I'll have to have a look at that. Not now, but another time. Um, but yeah, that's been fun. So we got to Ferros from the Prothean uh, Skyway. We're about to jump in the Mako. We finished Neveria. Uh, we found out that Saren's a bit of a controlling douchebag. Um, we found out some stories from the crewmates. You know, all the usual mass effecty stuff uh, but I think next stream probably Gran Turismo 3 will probably pick up where we left off we just finished the Sunday Cup on a Monday I might add for Gran Turismo 3 uh, I will probably pick up the S and R licenses tom tomorrow as well they will be I say fun they won't be fun they'll be stressful especially the S license I remember some of them lap times being absolutely fucking brutal to try and complete um, but the rally one should be a little bit easier. It's just like the fundamentals of rally driving. It's just like you you yeet it, you yeet the car, and you usually get gold. Uh, although some of the later ones get a little bit tricky. So with all that said, I'm gonna end the stream, get this uploaded to YouTube so you can catch up on the archive if you haven't. Uh, hello YouTube, by the way, if you've got this far, well done, thank you. Uh, and yeah, on to the next one, I suppose. Bye.